it's time for another Boom Shaka Laga video. Coming to you live and slightly recorded. Check it out, world. It's the end of October. And it's about 89 degrees down here. So it's a beautiful day to sit on the patio and, uh, you know, uh, I'm a seasonal beer drinker, you know what I'm saying? I've gone through this before with you guys that sometimes the style of beer that you drink is relative to the season, right? And so it's still freaking summer down here, um, which is a good thing. This is a good time of year. It's not too hot. It's just, you know, it's about 88 degrees or so. But the humidity's down and it's a nice day. So I'm out here chilling. Got my pepper plants are blooming again. I'll have a batch of uh, green chi uh, green chili salsa coming up here pretty soon that I made last time. It's pretty freaking awesome and pretty damn hot. Um, looks like she's getting ready to produce another batch. Uh, if I get about 12 green chilies off that thing, I can make a batch of some kick-ass salsa. So anyway, that being said, what goes better with green salsa? Not necessarily IPA. How about a Pilsner, right? I've got my Pilsner glass out. And I got here a box of winning. Don't be a wussy, man. When it comes to your fucking Pilsners. Right here, we have... Who you calling wussy? By Stone Brewing, California, San Diego. Um, this was the last box of this, and I haven't seen it replaced in a while. So I broke it out today, watching some college football. And let's check it out, world. Look at these cans. I told you guys about these cans, right? I don't know if you see the artwork on there. You got a little assistant's light here. It's got the devil head on the front there. And a uh, matte black can. Who you call a wussy right there on the big bold lettering. That's on the other dialogue on here. It says drink fresh numb skull. And that includes all you malt liquor drinkers. So this is your Pilsner style beer in a 16 ounce can. Arrogant Bastard Brewing. Uh, again, San Diego. And uh, this particular beer, freaking metal, man. Uh, Love the cans, love the artwork. Again, I'm a big fan of the craft beer artwork. Um, I think it's very part of the experience. And so we're gonna crack one of these open. It's even got the black beer tab on the top. That takes attention to detail too, to produce your cans with the extra black tab, you know. Oh, almost made a penalty. Gotta pour that shit in the glass. So, this is the video in which I'm going to challenge my subscribers. Some basic trivia, some Boom Shakalaga trivia. And the winner of such trivia is going to receive a free box of winning. Contents yet to be determined, but I promise you I will share with you beers that I wish I could keep for myself but all of them I assure you I've already had so it's no worries there and plus I can always get more you know look at this pour this is a 16 ounce pour my friends There's no room for head on this bastard it's an arrogant bastard I'm telling you Ooh, that right down the middle big old mushroom head don't be a wussy man so this beer, um, it's Pilsner style, like your typical, uh, you know, Bud Light replacement, right? Or Budweiser or Miller game day session beer replacement, right? It's Pilsner, it drinks light, um, re refreshing, delicious, and nutritious here on this uh, warm October day. And, uh, you know, it's too warm to get into the uh, pumpkin beers and all that shit, stouts yet but um yeah let's just check it out Oops, it is full it's 
be a little drier than say a mass-produced Budweiser or something like that would be. <clears throat> but uh, comes in at 5.8 percent, so it's not quite six. But that's a uh, that's a good ABV for a uh, session beer. So anyway, on to the trivia for all you wussies out there. I'm telling you, man, don't be a wussy. Drink craft beer, right? Nothing but craft beer. So, uh, got uh, five questions here for my subs. Those who can answer all five questions correctly will receive or will be in the eligible for a free box of winning. So, question number one. I've got lots of videos, first of all, on my channel. I've been doing this for quite a while now. So we're going to go back in the archives a little bit and challenge you guys to uh, either my longtime subs or uh, make you do some homework by checking out some of my videos. My favorite beer. What is my favorite beer? Um, I've mentioned this beer several times on several videos, making specific reference to being my favorite. So that is question number one. It's not a multiple choice. You must tell me <coughs> what is my favorite beer. Second question. When a box of winning, no, I'll tell you what. Um, I just screwed that question up. Let's go on to the next one. Where did the malt liquor come from in the video that I wiped my ass on cam come from? Yeah. Where did the malt liquor come from that I drank when I wiped my ass on camera? Yes, Boom Shaka Lager was the first and only so far in the YTDC to pull off such a stunt and not be ashamed about it. Um, let's see, next question. Another malt liquor related question. Back in the day when I was sparring with the malt liquor guys, which malt liquor brand was it that I made? I made a batch of malt liquor in my kitchen. What was the label on that malt liquor when I drank it? Making a batch of malt liquor in the kitchen, and then when I drank it, what was the label? Right. Fourth question. Being that Halloween's coming up here very shortly, um, following this weekend, who is my Halloween doppelganger. I have an alter ego that comes out of Halloween. And uh, so who is... This question must be answered prior to the next appearance of such doppelganger. So who is my doppelganger for Halloween? Now I'm going to come up with a fifth question. Tell you what, let's, let's wind it way back. How many hot sauces did I consume in my beer video in which I did hot sauce slam beer, right? Uh, hot sauce and beer combination video. Um, how many hot sauces did I sample and which one did I call my Spanish baby? There you go. Five questions. Favorite beer? Still my favorite. Where did the malt liquor come from? When I wiped my ass on video. What label was on the malt liquor of the batch that I made in my kitchen? Who's my evil Halloween doppelganger? And how many hot sauces did I consume in my hot sauce video? The first one. Not the set. I think there's two, but it would be the first and the original. Um, going back to, oh yeah, bonus question. What note, this may not even be on my beer channel, never mind. Never mind, no bonus. 
question. Unless I come up with one before I finish this beer. So anyway, happy Halloween to all you guys out there and girls, subs, beer drinkers alike, even those malt liquor fools. Um, if your weekend goes well, I will not burden you with much more time. But again, free box of winning. I can guarantee you it'll, it will at least contain four beers and uh, from here in Texas. And I would encourage you, once you receive such box of winning, that you make a video um, demonstrating receipt of such prize and uh, share it on my channel. I would appreciate that very much. So that being said, beers and cheers. That beer's not bad, but again, it's a pilsner, right? But don't be a wussy and sub my channel and answer the damn questions.